This video is about the Cebuano Made Products Exhibition. This is the One Town, One Product Exhibition of Cebuano manufacturers here in Cebu Island. And this is a project of the DTI and of course the provincial government of Cebu. One Town, One Product Philippines is a priority stimulus program for micro and small and medium scale enterprises as the government's customized intervention to drive inclusive local economic growth. growth. So there you go. I will show you what are the world-class products that is manufactured here in Cebu Island. So these are the samples of the product that is made here in Cebu Island. The weaving, the grass making of bags, shoes, the this is the parts, home decor, manufacturing, custom jewelries made of shells and other local materials. Gaia, all these natural ingredients made into drinks. Basket waving. food so all sorts of products that is proudly made here in Cebu Island these are made by the small micro and medium enterprises the SME MSME So I'll show you around what are the available products here on display. First, you have the Darren Kate footwear. It's proudly made in Karkar City. They are on display in the new Karkar City public market. And yes, Karkar is known as the makers of footwear here in Cebu Island, Karkar City in the south, on the south rather. So this is one thing that Karkar is producing, aside of course that they are known for their um, crispy lechon and their chicharon car car is also known as makers of shoes so this is the darren kate footwear of car car city This is the JJW Fashion Center of Minglanilla and as you know, we are famous here in Cebu Island as the makers of fashion accessories from our local materials. As you see, she got here bangles made of shell, bracelets, and other souvenirs. So they got some earrings. OMG, I like collecting earrings. Thank you so much, Mom Miller, for my earrings. I will have to show you my collections of the different earrings. I like all the different design, not necessarily like this. I like all this. And of course, I'm not here for myself. You can see some other products that they have bags made of shell inlay
Pagpili lang anak, hindi ko nang marang niya. So, JJW Fashion Center, Minglanilia, makers of top quality fashion accessories and souvenirs made of indeed local materials. Next on this side is Capis Furniture Trading of Argao. So Capis is actually the old Spanish style shell where they make the windows in the Spanish time and they are now back to being fashionable again, you know? So like dividers, 7,500 made of capis. This is the shell. Capis furniture trading are now. So the CapisFurnitureTrading.com is their website. You can see it here. Then behind the Capis Furniture Trading is the Ferrangeli Guitar Crafters from Mactan Island, Lapu-Lapu City. Because you know, in Lapu-Lapu, there's a few that makes guitar. You got Allegra guitar. And this is the Ferrangeli guitar. And as you know, it may, the make is different kinds of wood, local wood. And then prices range from the cheapest, of course, to the most expensive one, like the exclusivity because uh, you can look at my video about Allegra guitars and I was able to talk to the owner they're showing me their products from their cheap guitars to the most expensive one now this is the Pirangeli guitar hand crafter so you can buy souvenirs small guitars to carry on with your suitcase like a pen holder So this one town, one province pro product display is inspired after the Japanese style of one, t one village, one product. So our governor is working with our Department of Trade to promote our local manufacturers, our small, micro and medium scale enterprises. So this is the Lamak Multipurpose Cooperative from Tuburan Province of Cebu. They are in the north part of Cebu Province.
they have different products here. You got a coconut sugar. Then the vinegar, spice vinegar. They also have this Spanish style bangus, coconut water treated sardines. And of course, they have other products like the cocoa basket for your cocoa planters. Cocoa planters. And then the coco peat for your ornamental plants and then this coco rope to hang your climbing plants on so the bag is 20 pesos each I will need some but I can't do it right now because I'm filming I'll just come back Here is the San Remejo native basket industry. The native basket industry is not only contained in San Remejo, I know because I've been to the north of Cebu province and there's a lot of basket makers but the, what's different here is their finish is really good. The San Remejo native basket industry. Look at this. This is food tray inlaid with shell. And this is 750 pesos. My OFW brothers and sisters this is a good gift for your foreign friends and also the former Cebuanos that don't live here anymore. They can have these decorations around their houses. You know, accentuating their kitchens or any decorative part of their houses having the Filipino touch. So this is from the San Remio Remigio native basket industry. These products here are from Carmen Cebu, province of Cebu Island. You know, these are from the Cantumog Farmers Association and they are also processing coconut derived food products because they have a processing area there. So you can see that's the Cantupa, the Cantumog Farmers Association, Jeans Abaca, and then the Tabos whatever is the name is they are coordinating collaborating but the University of the CTU you know Cebu Technical Technological University and the LGU unit of Carmen so let's have a close look at what are their products on display they got Acapulco soap say Acapulco mom kaning kaning atanom Oh, this is a Mauba? Makaon sa mani, ma'am. Oh, it's a good for up, up. Oh, for skin disease. Acapulco, this is the plant, the, how the, it looks like as a natural plant in the picture. And it's good for your skin disease and all that. Mauba, an-an ka na mga kuan? Because it's made with virgin coconut oil and also he got some dishwashing liquid hand sanitizers from the Kantu Farm Farmers Association he had a moisturizer beauty oil beauty oil pila sa ni madam 180 and then other products that he got they got here macaroons baked products oh so this is still from the Cantofa the Canto Candumog Farmers Association 
So this is the Bangus Spanish style sardines. They have baked goods product, cakes, macaroons, and here they have some wallets. madam. Jeans abac wraps made of abaca. One of our strong fibers here in the Philippines is the abaca. So this is the products from Carmen Cebu. Next is the products from Barili Cebu in the south of Cebu province. The Banabu and Banica Norma's native products. So you can see all the hand wave products, baskets, mats, hats, all made from natural um, local natural materials and made by the people of Barili Cebu. Look at their cute hats. Shame it's not big. I like big hats. I got like a one meter hat that I carry around instead of umbrella. I'll just roll it and with my backpack. See, they got mats, hand wave mats made of indigenous materials here in Cebu Island. There you got the placemats. Some are decorated with shell. So it's a good accent to your kitchen table when you serve the food. And it's very Filipino because look at that, my dear brothers and sisters. You got the shell that is very labor-intensive labor product. Look how they have to bleach these tiny shells. And then decorate it there together with a hand-woven placemats. Pila ma? One. Two fifty. Can you said? Oh, ma. Grabi niyo. So for only three hundred pesos, look at this. How labor intensive it is. From catching the shell to bleaching the shell and now weaving it in together with a hand woven mat. I mean, place stuff on that. Okay on the tabletop that will be a good attraction then they have their hats shame that they're tiny I could have bought one I don't like their nindot din yung hat no waving waving papa ko kakita umbrella ah umbrella they call this umbrella by the way ladies and gentlemen I told the lady here I haven't seen this hat like this that's got waves you know look at that so that's indigenous design that's from the native of Barili Cebu. So they come up with that design. Here are some top quality. I could see it's top quality accessories, bags, and shoes from Casa de Pinta Cebu City. So look at their products, so different because they are painting it. That's Mr. Bean there. Wow. I could say that this bag is so world class. Look at this. And then they hand, hand painted to mom. So they hand paint that one. Look at this one. So it's been nominated for the best dress booth. Wow. There's some other ones here. They also have shoes, wallets, and you can paint even your name on the bags. On what design you want. I 
iconic. So Casa de Penta is from Cebu City. These products here are from Argao, Cebu, another province, another town in the province of Cebu South. Hinablon means weaving. So this product here are being woven from made of local materials. But look at the quality of what they produce out of their weaving. So there's some samples of what they are doing with their cloth. Some international fashion designers are actually mentioning some of this cloth that they order from Hinablon of Argao, interweaving, using the cloth, interweaving with their designs. So they got some nice scarves here. Mom Regina, oh, good for Christmas gifts. Yes, a suggestion. So this is from Argao. can see Hinablon is hand woven products hand woven with heart woven this is the burr and burr handicrafts trading of Lapu Lapu City Mactan so look at all the shell products that they produce they even have dried starfish here decoration for the bathroom it's real starfish and look at this how unique this is and even this one wow then they got these coasters made of abaca and shell. And they also have more shell products here. And they even have bags. But they are more known for their shell products. Look at this one. all the different shells decorated into like a tool for a doorway wow and all this this can be um cigarette pot ashray this shows i don't Oh, look at this. And look at their other products here. They got all golden curries. Wind chimes made of different shells. Door in pants. Oh. I was correct. It was for door entrance, and then they can decorate it with shells instead of some climbing ivies. This is your choice. 
that you can have your Filipino touch on your houses there, wherever you are abroad. And to open up our open life is, of course, our very own. They got baskets, bags, and different kinds of wind chimes. I will go around the other side because here, look at this. I don't know what it is for, but it's good, good decorations. I usually see this decorated on bathrooms, made of shell. And look at all these wind chimes, made of different kinds of shell. Look at this. So this is from Berber Handicraft of Lapu-Lapu Cities, Mactan Island, Cebu. And behind her is the Almar Jewelry Manufacturing from Cordoba Island, province of Cebu. Because someone was correcting me that Cordoba Island if you actually look at the map, Cordoba seems like a little bit for separated from Mactan and connected with bridge. But it's not known as Cordoba Island. Of course, I know that. I'm just being technical. But this is Almar Jewelry Manufacturing from Cordoba. And you can see the quality of their products. They are into fashion accessories. Very nice. So look at this, very nice. Nicely designed. Next is the Diedre Export Trading from Talisay City, Cebu. So look at all the products of the Diedre Export Trading. The fish decoration, lechon pen holder. Look at that, little lechon. And this is your pen holder. You got a hand carved deer and all this is hand carved they also have little items here like this hand carved cover for the gl glass so look at this one very nice Soap dish. Other soap dish made of marble, carved marble. So look at the sun mirror there. Fish. I like the fish decoration. That's three thousand five hundred.
So they also have baskets made of fibers, made of like sticks. Very decorative napkin holder, you got dog design, the fish design, and the chopping board set. And they even have a very nice lampshade. And then here's the So again, this is from Diedre Export Trading of Talisay City. There's some hand carved wooden spoon. So I got someone asking, that's a regular viewer, where he can get big spoons for decorations like a, the old fashioned way. I think they can make to order your order, sir. Like your, what you're asking about big fork and spoon as decoration. So someone was asking the same question right now, and they do when you make your own order. Bukuan sa mo, sir, kanang namay nang utana pa magpahi mo siya kanang kutsara tinidur ng kahoy. So pwede. So you can just call them. This is like this one that you want it at whatever size you want, sir. Their number is his. Last but not the least, here in the first roundabout is the Adorno 72. They are on display in Ayala most of the time. But you can visit their showroom. They are from Cebu City. But they are the makers of top quality home decorations and accessories. Look at that, what you're looking there on the wall. And so is this other paintings that they have. Look, not paintings, it, but it's made of indigenous materials, but the design is really good. Now the Cebu exhibit of Otop, one town, one product, still extends here in the second floor roundabout of Ayala Center Cebu for non for food products. Non food is on Rotonda one and we'll start with the La Ponsas Masarial from Mandawe City. So La Ponsas is actually quite known for quality masarial. Masarial is um, made from peanut peanut and milk so it's quite an um, old-fashioned dessert and you can see there it it looks like this so you can even see that La Ponsas is since 1800s I know the products name has been quite popular here in Cebu and it's from Mandawe City but I know that Masarial is also a known product from Mandawi City and now they also carry banana chips aside from Masarial but La Ponsas is known for Masarial so that's Masarials from La Ponsa Mandawi City Cebu another food product from Cebu City is the Chilin Chicharon Chicharon is actually known to be coming from Karkar and the best ones are from Karkar but Chilin as well is now becoming popular because they are readily available in supermarkets they come in small to big packs and you can buy them on different kinds look at this big chicharron here on the side that is displayed so people that really love the chicharron can have a gift like this and finish it within 10 minutes. Oh my god. 
Be less than me, sir. <laughs> For only 265, you got a very big chicharron. And you can finish in 10 minutes. <laughs> There's the prices. It's very affordable. 165. That's 265, the big one. You got 50 pesos there for regular spicy, 95 for the pork cracklings and chili and chicharron. The price list here for the kilo one is now from 1,100 pesos for one kilo of chicharron. Three port there. You can see the prices. I don't need to read it. But uh, one kilo is 1,100. Then you get one half by fifty. So Chilin Chicharon of Cebu City. Right on this other side is the La Lanao Women's Association of the Laguet. They are producing this products made of virgin coconut oil, massage oil, tablea oil, was this cacao made of cacao tablea, coconut oil, this is baked products, this is coconut vinegar. So these are the products they offer, virgin coconut oil, massage oil, cacao tablea, cacao, coco peat, coco core, genuine net coconut sauce. But they are from Lanao, Dalaget, Cebu City, and that is their contact details. If you are interested about their products, they even got flower pots, hanging pots, fruit ball, doormats, and a lot more. And I could see it from here that they do have it here. So there you are. Coconut planters. Colorful ones. We've got a cocoa sauce, coconut virgin oil, and some of these cocoa products that is already colored and very decorative. Because I usually see this as normally non colored one like that. But they have managed to color it and even color it beautifully. So these are baked good products from Bakerlin Bakery in Middle Yen. From my friend Rose. This is her province, I mean hometown province of Cebu, Otak. So they are producing baked good products. The O-Top is quite known Biscuit of Cebu. They also have a tata sa inyong brand product though. Galletas, huevos, bao bao, patata, and I'll go on the other side. Plain is known for their O-Top. O-Top and patata ma'am, this one. Yeah, O-Top and patata. So the O-Top, they have different flavor. You can see the different color brand. That is pandan. This is or chocolate, the ube, otap, and they also have the this one, no, the sugarless, sugarless, sugarless toppings. otap, oh. sugarless toppings. This one is the original. Okay, with uh, with sugar. Yes, and this one is the sweet chili. Sweet chili otap. Yes, uh, wow, they really are innovating their. We also Baked have the garlic goods. otap, the sugarless, garlic. sugarless toppings but garlic flavored. Wow. Yeah. So you can he see that otap doesn't only comes in one flavor now. They have what they mentioned here, the ube, the bandan, the spicy honey glaze, the chili flavor. Wow, I, ha I haven't heard that before. So Baker Lane from Middle Yen. Cebu. Middle Yen, by the way, is next uh, to uh, before Bantayan, Dan Bantayan, uh, Dan Bantayan Town, in the north of Cebu Province. So that's Baker Lane. So this is from Minglanilia, Bak Bak Barkiron. 
sa rin ang Barky Rondong? Pulburon? Ah, oh, it's a Barkilius and Pulburon. So, but it's shaped like Barkilius Gapon. So, it's a combination. Ah, okay. The Pulburon is inside the Barkilius. The Barkilius is like, um, you know, like, for a tube. Like a tube, and then the Pulburon is inside. That's why it's called Barkiron. And it comes with different flavor, the classic, the mango, the pinipig, also naga ube, and rolled cookies, bakeron. So you can see it here. And they also have other snack products, the peanut cookies, the salbaro, and the piaya. But their main product is the Barkeron. Here, this is Rachel and Jundi's homemade food products from Talisay. They're actually quite known now because their products are now available in the groceries. They have the chili, uh, baguong shrimp paste, and then the ginamos. And they got the chili garlic sauce. That's their products there. Ginamo special. The baguong. Chili pepper. This one is salted with garlic. This is sweet and spicy. So three kinds of flavor. What's up, Malaysia? Pila ng amount na? Six fifty as a gift pack now, ready for Christmas. Then Rachel Hanjondis also have tableya products, sardine products, banana chips, and tana bangus, bangus, and then that's mana yung bago. That's your new one. This is chili garlic sauce. Buttered garlic sauce. For people that love garlic, you have different choice. Chili garlic and the buttered garlic. And they have the achara. Guys, I'm going to go to And they have the achara. All natural achara. Preserved food. Look, they're actually achara. Usually is shredded. They have it in sticks. Like pickles. So that's Rachel and John D's. Homemade food products from Talisay City, Cebu. So this is Audrey's Confectioneries from Cebu City. They are known to the makers of mango caramel. Now they have banana chips, sweet and salted banana chips, and the mango caramel here, which Audrey's are quite known for. Mango caramel classic. Then there you get chocolate mango caramel, mango buko, and the chocolate mango caramel again in big packs. See? So they have a sale by five, take one free echo bag. So this is from Big City Food Factory, Cebu City, the Big City Calamansi Juice. It's proudly made in Cebu because this Calamansi is our local lemon. And now they're readily available, ready to drink in any sizes you want. Here, this is the Tuburan Coffee from Tuburan, town of Cebu North. Tuburan Coffee is the first Cebu homegrown specialty coffee trees since 2012 that are planted within the municipality of Tuburan. 
So they are thereby tagging it as fine robusta specialty coffee. So it is now available here, the Tuburan coffee roasted coffee beans from Tuburan Cebu. And it comes with coffee beans or drip coffee and also an eye powder now this one so this is the drip coffee from the tuburon coffee I honestly I haven't tasted this myself but I have seen this about the tuburon coffee is now offered in our local grocery especially here in Metro The last but not the least, but it's the best. It's the best torta in Argao, Chitang's Torta. I have been to their main restaurant in Argao, and you can check out my video about Chitang's Torta in Argao. And they are the best torta, which is made of coconut wine, tuba. And Chitang's is actually the original makers of torta in Argao. There. This is how it comes. The torta. And they also have different product now. They have the gillian, tablea. They even have some other baked goods. But the torta is what Chitangs are known for. For the home Chitangs, torta is the home of original torta from Argao since 1980 and I'm gonna have to buy some because when I went to Argao I went to the restaurant and they torta the torta that they offer there is really good you can either have it eaten straight or have it warm with a bit of ice cream and it's beautiful so this is the Chitang's torta tagpila ma'am 60? Can you feel like it? 50. So that's small and big, so I have to buy some.